here's some of the old training tapes that we had on the skio. Registered 1989 in America. This particular set of software instructions is from 2010, but I hope you understand and like the history of the ski. Hello everybody, we are going to take a look at the new exciting additions that we have added to the 2014 version 3.3.2014, now available on our qxsubspace.com official website. To initiate the program, we are going to double click on the Dupter 64 icon. The program will load up and at 25% the device recognition box will appear. One of the first features we wanted to add to this version is the BHO legality check. This means that with this button that I will show you in a second, BHO check, you can check whether your device, your account, and your activation is legal on our official website. It is very important to protect our clients from any counterfeit devices that can be sold out there or hacked softwares. If your activation has been hacked and it is not legal, then it is very likely that the ones who have who have done this activation for you have made other changes in the workings of the software. So your device will not be as powerful or will not work as intended by the manufacturer. We cannot guarantee the results or the efficacy of the device and your software. So please, we ask everybody to do a BHO check and make sure that you are legally registered and activated. Let's see what happens in this case that we have set up. We get an instant response. In this case, we are informed that our device is legally registered. That means that is in our official database, but there is no legal activation associated, which means that we have installed the version, but we do not, we have not made the activation yet. We are required to immediately go and download if we haven't already the newest version available and activate through qxupspace.com to make sure, as I said before, that we have a working, verified, legal and compliant software. This is the only way we can guarantee your efficacy. We are going to set our device. We are now going to activate our version and then we are going to continue with the exciting new features of the 2014 version. We close to continue. Okay, so we are now activated. We are going to continue. We click on password. Click on OK. One of the things that we have added to the version are three new Eductor themes that you can select and that will upload the um, pictures in the background. We are going to select Eductor 2 for the hell of it, but we want to take a look at the home use prescription as well. So from here, Eductor Themes, we can select home use prescription. This will open the home use panel after the calibration. Please don't forget that if we do it from operation themes, that means that you want to be locked in Skio themes and not use the rest of the program after the calibration. So if you just want to use the Eductor themes and all of the rest of the program, please click on home use prescription from this button. So we have selected home use. We are going to enter the password 0210. Click OK. Select one patient. Create one patient because we don't have to use. We are required to do the demographics, number of organs removed, drugs, cigarettes, and all of the rest question. The rest of the questions we already know. Name patient. And we are going to save. Close and we are doing calibration. Once calibration is complete, we click OK. We are asked whether we want to close. Yes. So now we are in the home use panel. These are one click therapies designed for simple use. We have added a lot of the new, a lot of new stuff in the previous versions, like reduce negative emotions, build brain symmetry, release mental superpowers, 
electro transcendental meditation, very powerful therapy. And now we've added four new, the dormant intellect gene, 10 minute therapy. Please be aware that you do not need to set the time to 10 minutes. It is an automatic 10 minute setup. Weight loss through biofeedback, circulation stabilization through relaxation, and lucid dreaming stimulation through EEG. Very powerful as I have discovered myself. So with these therapies, you need to select the therapy you want to do. You will be asked whether you want to play Desi's voice. Please select no. Do we want to play music? No, do we want to play any videos? No, if we select yes, we are going to be have the possibility to select from a range of music. Then we set the time in minutes, and then we click start. The program will calculate the time left in minutes till completion. When we are done into the home use, we close, and then we move on and continue with the test. Once we are done with the test, now we can do one of the new therapies that we have added to the Autofocus Bioresonances app. Please click on it on the top menu bar and then scroll all the way down to the last four treatments. We have added Autozap Mental Health and Bowel Flora, Autozap Erectile Dysfunction, Autozap Premenstrual Syndrome, and Autozap Childhood Diseases. These are all five minute therapies. What we have also added to uh, the new version is under System Power Settings, the possibility to change the test background from men, old men, Da Vinci men that was in the past, the woman that is now associated with the doctor or the Eye of God picture. We have also given the possibility to change the test grid colors. Another new addition to the program is in Risk Profile we have added the Symptom Operalization button, Symptom Inventory, right at the bottom. So we click on the button and it takes us to the Hemolytic page where we have all these questions that simply and directly do not lead, without leading the patient to specific answer, we let them respond naturally and find out in Hanuman's method about their symptoms. Once we have entered primary diseases, and all of the other the answer to all of the other questions we click load prepare and scan to exit we just close and close we close risk profile and we take a look at another edition that we have done which is the wasa the wellness app site access site we click on it and this will take us to the quantum wellness apps for health.com where we have three types of apps that we can give our patients. Nowadays, everything is about smartphones and applications that people can download into their phones and find uh, a lot of information that they need regarding their issues. So we have informational books, we click on it, and we see a whole range of incredible amount of information for every, every condition. We have informational videos, Again, an incredible list. And we'll just scroll down quickly to see how long it is. See, we're just, we're not even at the half of it. So it's huge. And we have treatment prescription videos. Again, a huge list of information. Very valuable and very useful. To go back to the program, we just need to close. Uh, apart from all of the new additions that we have added, we have fixed a lot of the things in the background, like the Viz Dictionary, like the Indigo, uh, used with the Skio software in Skio mode with the Big, which didn't work in the past. So we hope you enjoy the new 2013 version, and uh, please let us know any So we hope you enjoyed the 2013 version. Hello everyone, we are now going to take a look on how we can get to the Symptom Inventory button in the CLASP Eductor64 program. We double click on the Eductor64 icon. The program loads up. We will not restore the last patient. At 25% we get the device recognition box. Where we can do our BHO check. We get an instant response, 
as to whether our device is legally registered and activated on our official website. We move on with the close. We click on continue and then password. 0210 our password. We go to demographics and select a patient. We click on close. We do calibration. Then we move on to the test. Once we are done with the test, we go to programs. Then we select risk profile. We load new patient's data. And we scroll down to the bottom of the risk profile and we will see the symptom inventory button. We click on it and we are now in the symptom inventory. Hello everyone. Another exciting addition to the 2014 version is the big device validation page that we can access from inside the main software. We are going to start the Eductor 64 software. Make sure the harnesses are attached correctly. We have use conductive gel if necessary for best results. 25% our device recognition box. Please continue and password. We enter our regular password 0210. And graphics. We select the patient. Close. We do calibration. Then we move on to the test button. We start the bid. And then we start any therapy. Let's do one of the new. Zap therapies that we have added, for example, mental health and ball flora. We started. Now we have the option of starting the second waveform generator for the eductor. We click. Okay, and then we can select the electropotential volume, autofocus, minimum, median, maximum. We'll leave it on autofocus. We can then select one of the chakras that we want to work on violet, indigo, blue, green, yellow, orange. This will come back in a second. Or we can use resonant level 4, 3, 2, and 1. We'll use the yellow chakra. And we can also select the harness points. I usually leave, we usually leave all on, unless we really want to do left foot, right foot, left arm, right arm off, head off. We have all of the possible combinations that we can use. We'll leave all on, and then we move to the big device validation. We start to measure. Make sure now harnesses are properly connected. We have to give it a second. This wheel is working, is on. We can see that we have yellow all on and out of focus, which we can see into the other panel. So the big will show us exactly what we have selected here. Okay, we see how the frequency, both frequency generators are working. Harnesses are perfectly connected, and we can see the body electric working in real time. Once the skier is working, there's, it's off, this all goes off as well and back on again, depending on how stimulation happens. At any time, we can go back and select a different chakra that we want to work on. We now work on the orange chakra. Once the therapy is over, we will see that both signal generators will be off. Now we have disconnected the harnesses. We reconnect. We'll give it a second to stabilize. Okay. 
and then we disconnect again. You can see how perfectly this works. Another exciting new addition to the 2014 software are the wellness apps. We are going to show how to access the wellness apps from inside the main program. We double click on the Dr. 64 icon. At 25% we get our device recognition box. Don't forget about the BHO check button that you can do to check the legality of your device and or software activation. We wait for the program to load. And then we click on continue. We click on password. Okay, 0210. We go to demographics, select a patient from the list, we close, proceed with the calibration, with the test, and inside the test panel, we have the WASA -A in the top menu bar button. Then the first is wellness app site. We click on it and it will take us to quantum wellness apps for health dot com site where we have informational books that we can prescribe informational videos huge amount of information available at just one click and treatment prescription videos we can download into our patient's computer or smartphone the cyber magnetic chair is a new addition that it has its own software that we are going to take a look at right now When we start the program, we have the cyber magnetic chair on the, on the chair where the patient is. He's back on the, on the little so-called chair. Uh, we have the connections to the computer, headphone jack, microphone jack. If we want, we can put the headphones so that only the patient will hear the sounds that are coming out. First, we have a voice test. 12 seconds we speak when it says okay and then we speak into the microphone for 12 seconds we we as in the patient for 12 seconds so that our um, voice and the modulations and the frequencies are measured by the software then we get back the result so we have several options once we have uh, measured the voice we can do a scan sound start which will do a scan and we'll select the best tone that is uh, now good for our patient. Sound treatments will pl we'll play the sound that we have selected. We can select Solfeggio videos which will show us and uh, also the patient. This is important that the patient also sees and hears the video. Solfeggio scan will scan all of the Solfeggio tones. And with the sulfagio treatment, we can treat with a specific tone to the patient. The cyber magnetic loop start. It will select one tune that will play in a loop for the patient. The difference between the scan sound start and cyber magnetic loop start is that this will select one tone that will play in a continuous loop and scan sound start will select a series of tones that will be played in a loop. Cyber magnetic loop choice gives us, gives us the choice to select from uh, different frequencies. Angel Songs also gives us a choice to select uh, different tunes that we want. The Angel Songs is the place where we can add our own music. So to do that we would start a total commander. We would go to C, dr C drive in class 32. inside that cyber magnetic multimedia and angel songs and inside here we can copy our own songs going back to the cyber magnetic chair we have a chromosome scan
by clicking on the chromosome scan, we will see on this label, we will see what chromosome is selected to work on by the software. Chromosome treatment will send the treatment to the patient. We can anytime stop any therapy with the stop button.